In this video, I'm sharing some great LinkedIn post ideas for your business. These are post ideas that will attract leads as well as build your authority, show your personality and convert followers into leads. In this video, I'll show you six LinkedIn post ideas with examples and templates, two post ideas for building authority, two post ideas for showing your personality and two post ideas for turning followers into leads. Now, there are three content types you need to attract clients on LinkedIn. If you haven't watched my LinkedIn content strategy video yet, go and check that out. But the three types of content are authority content, personal content, and proof content. Authority content is content that attracts your dream clients, attracts people who are interested in your industry and your offer. This content also showcases your knowledge and experience, so it builds your authority. Then personal content are relatable stories that tie back to your expertise. So you relate it back to what you do or what you offer. And this content shows your personality and your story. Lastly, we've got proof content. Proof content shows proof of your work or knowledge as well as proof of your results in your industry or with your offer. This content is to show your dream clients and leads that you can actually help them you're proving that you can help them get the results that you promise you can help them get. Now, when you use this strategy, which I call the dominating authority strategy, you'll build authority and attract clients, you'll show your personality and professional story, and you'll show the proof that you can get your clients results. If you want help building a content strategy or creating content, you can book a free strategy call with me using the link in the description. But let's get into the two ideas, examples, and templates for each of these content types. I've actually got a LinkedIn post templates product that you can download, link is in the description. So we're gonna use this to show you a bunch of templates and different ideas. So in this product, you get a bunch of LinkedIn post ideas, as well as templates that you can use to write your content. You can copy and paste and fill in, and make that very easy. And then there are also examples where I've used the templates to write a post. So let's get into it. First template is this list template. There's two great things about this template. The first is it's very easy to write. And the second is people love it. People love easy, temp easy list templates like this, give people a quick win and it's super easy to write. So you get more reach for making content like this and you can just whip out a bunch of them. So here's the template number of tools, things, or habits you used to get some sort of benefit. An example would be the 10 tools I use to create engaging content online, okay? Then you've got each of the tools, you list tools, and you've got a conclusion. And then you can add a question as well. And in addition to that, you can also have a call to action or follow me for more content now I do follow me for more content like this, but if you do create multiple different content topics, then you can use this format of follow me for more content on this topic, this topic, and this topic. However, what I suggest is you post this question in the comment section, because what I found is people do not respond to this question. It doesn't matter how much reach you get, how many people comment, people do not comment on this question. It's better to have it in the comment section so when people get to the comment section, they can see that question and reply to that. So that's some advice on using these templates, but this is super, super easy. Here's the example, 10 tools I use for creating content that brings organic views and inbound leads. And then we've got a list of tools. And then this can then be turned into a carousel and a video even. So you can turn this into so much different content. Here I've got a list of 10 books that'll make you write better content than 90% of creators over light, overnight. And there we tell you why you need these books. Then I tell you these books will make you a great writer. I tell you all the books. Then if you wanna know the main takeaways from each book, you can go into the carousel where I break down each book and the main takeaways from it. If I didn't have the carousel here, then I would have left the author names here as well. But that's a list post. Very, very easy. Next, we've got a perspective. Next, we've got a perspective change post. This is used to change people's minds on something that they may have thought or to share a contrarian opinion. So let's get into it. This is the template. So a lot of people say, and then you've got the comments perspective in your industry. So you could say, a lot of people say AI is great for writing posts. They're wrong. AI might help you come up with ideas. It might write a whole post for you, but it doesn't 
write good posts. <laughs> it doesn't give you the best ideas. And then you go through this. So I'm not going to explain every single step of the template. If you want the templates, you can download them by buying them. The link is in the description down below, but you can just screenshot the screen and use this if you want. So first we basically explain the common perspective. We get into why people think this common perspective. Then I point out why this common perspective isn't really helping you get what you want. Then I tell you the problems of that common perspective. And then I tell you this new perspective and give you examples of how to use this new perspective. That is how this template works. Okay. So if we go into this post, which is a post that I actually posted. So let's see this. People think posting on more platforms equals more views. They're wrong. You'll get your names locked in, stopping scammers. That's great. But you can't do that without a spreading thing. Focus on one pot. Focusing on one platform equals focusing re focused results. It's cool to secure links. It's cool to be everywhere, but it slows you down. The problem is how do you grow a target audience fast? How do you build authority and inbound leads? Focusing on one platform gives you the answers. Know your format, study the platform, learn formats that work. And then I get into, you know, how you do it. And then we have a conclusion. That's that. I've got another post which is like going viral won't grow your business. Here's why and what to do instead. People assume more traffic equals more sales. This is wrong because more traffic from more people who can't afford your offer is useless. Who don't value your offer is useless. You don't need your offer is useless. The truth is more targeted traffic equals more followers. So this is another perspective change. But as you can see, I've evolved the template. I'm not using the exact template. I'm just using the thought behind the template of showing you the common perspective, telling you why the common perspective is wrong and then introducing the new perspective. So that is generally what you want to do. The templates just show you an easy way to do that without having to think too much. And then after you use the templates a few times, you should be able to write your own content using the things that you learned from those templates. Next, we're going to get into the personal content. So here we have a story which is really easy. I just do it in chunks and bullet points. So first of all, it's like whatever amount of time ago I started doing X, then you say where you started, what happened, where you started, what happened. So this is the template. X amount of time ago, I started X. I had X amount of stuff. Then X amount of time ago, I experienced some sort of change. And that led to me having X amount of stuff. Then X amount of time ago, I started using this completely new opportunity or method. At that point I had XXX and then you can keep on going with this. You can make a new discovery or you can make this short and not go through so many different new discoveries. You can just say, you know, X amount of time ago, I started doing this and this is where I started. This is what I had. And then I realized that I could do this and then it led to this instead. So this template just shows you how you can make this a long post, but you can make this a really short post as well. This is an example of a post that I have actually posted as well, which is a post that did very, very well. I think it's got like, yeah, 87 reactions, thousands of impressions. So four weeks ago, I started posting on LinkedIn. This was when I started posting on LinkedIn and then I had zero. Of course, I had zero followers, zero impressions, zero engagement. After two, what, two weeks of posting and getting used to the platform, this is what I had. So this is what I gained. After four weeks of posting, and this is when I posted it, I have, and this is where I was at. And then I explained steady, predictable growth is my favorite because it is. And then these results are from, so this is how I got these results, posting six times a week, following a content strategy, optimizing my LinkedIn profile, and basically teaching you how you can do the same. And then I'm like, I didn't get to 10K followers and 10,000 a month because that, that would have been great <laughs> for marketing, but I'm happy with my process. I'm happy with my progress because I've been able to share my expertise, connect with like-minded people, get better at writing, gather data to optimize my content. Going viral is nice, consistent, predictable growth is better. So it's very simple. This is where I was. This is what I did. This is where I am. This is how I got there. This is what I gained from it. And generally you want to go with uncommon gains. So things that people don't generally think about. So it's not about the vanity metrics of having more followers or having more well, all these metrics that I've already given you, I'm telling you 
the different benefits that I've got from this that you wouldn't really expect. So the unexpected benefits, like sharing my expertise, connecting with like-minded people, getting better at writing. So that's that. But absolutely free, you can create two months of LinkedIn content with my 74 LinkedIn post ideas and hooks with examples. Just scan the QR code on the screen or click on the link in the description to download these right now. You've got nothing to lose except for the opportunity to download this PDF because it won't be free and available forever. So go and download that now. Next we have, I quit something most people want after X. Here's the template. So first you start with that hook. I quit something most people want after something happened. And then you say at first it's what I wanted, but really, it wasn't what I wanted, like it was something that had a negative effect and then you explain that negative effect. Then you explain what you did to get there, but then you realized, you know, it wasn't for you because why wasn't it for you? Then you say the new thing that you started to do and how it's better than the thing that you was chasing before, but it wasn't easy. This is what you went through, but you were able to make it work because of X. And then now you talk about the benefits that you've gained from doing this and how long it's taken you to get here, but you're thankful that you went through the bad experience because now you've got what you really wanted. So that's how we write that. And then this is an example that I've also posted already. I quit my business after getting 4,549 Twitter followers in 69 days. So this is something that people may want, like getting thousands of followers in a few days is something that is impressive to people who haven't gotten thousands of followers in a few days, well, 69 days, it's not a few days, but in like a month or two, I quit my business after getting this many followers in this many days, here's why. And then at first it was what I wanted. My fitness business was off to a great start. I was growing fast. I was building authority. I was selling a few books, things that people want. But the truth is I was miserable. I was bored of making fitness content. I wasn't getting enough book sales. I was sick of editing videos. I studied Twitter and copywriting for five years to get these results, but I realized I didn't want it because my heart wasn't in it. I knew I'd build a nice business if I kept going, but I wouldn't be happy. I felt like a failure. I quit. Then I pivoted. I started offering content marketing services because I knew I'd never get bored. And I have a lot of expertise, experience and value to give, but it wasn't easy. I was learning a new platform, I had a nine to five job, so my time was limited. I was starting from scratch again, but I've done this all before. I've started from zero without any help. I've built businesses from the ground up. I've proven my authority and expertise with content and I'm determined to make it work. And then today I'm getting inbound leads, I'm growing my personal brand and other benefits. And I'm never going back to where I was before, but I'm glad that I started my fitness business because it taught me what I really wanted because I found my calling and I love content marketing. Add a related question and then follow me for more content like this in a big picture on my face. And we've got two examples for proof. X amount of time ago, I did something scary. So here is our template. X amount of time ago, I did something scary. I did something that your ICP struggles with. ICP is your ideal client profile. This is explained in this post templates download because at the beginning I teach you about writing and ICP and teach you about what some of these common terms mean. So keep that in mind. You did something that your ICP struggles with or potential client target audience. We'll just say target audience because that's easier for people to understand. I've done X amount of thing your target audience struggles with. I had common problem your target audience has. Now I have benefit that your target audience wants because the service that you offer leads to the benefit that above. So you explain how the service that you offer leads to that benefit above. So you're basically convincing your potential client that if they take you up on your offer, they'll get the benefits that you're describing in this post. So you say, you know, this is how it does, but you'll discover exactly how I did. If you're selling a course, if you're selling a course, then you'll discover how exactly how I did in this course, or you'll learn exactly how I did if you book a call with me, or if you sign up to my newsletter or go to this blog post. This is a promotional post. So you give them the information of how you was doing something wrong. And then you learn that this new thing is better and if you want to learn more about how to apply this new thing, click on this link. That's how it works. And then I did this post, but I didn't actually post it. So I've written this post. So two months ago, I did something scary. I uploaded my first post to LinkedIn. I've published over 3000 videos, hundreds of blog posts, hundreds of live streams. I'm a veteran of content creation, but I was starting again. Had zero followers, zero impressions, zero engagement. After four weeks of posting, these are the same stats from before, so I'm not going to repeat it. Now I have this all because of following a targeted content strategy, consistently posting valuable content and writing engaging posts. The best part is you'll discover exactly how I do 
all three of these things in my simple guide to content marketing. Click here to download it for free. Maybe by the time you're watching this, that won't be available anymore, but it is a bonus. And then after these templates, you also get tips of how to use these templates. So I've got this after every template, by the way. Remember, link to download these is in the description down below. And then lastly, a case study template. So it's how I helped a client get an outcome in time frame. This is the template I helped your ICP get benefit in time frame. He transformed his problem into a benefit. Here's a breakdown of the results you got. How did I do it? Then you explain how you did it. So by following this powerful principle, for me, it would be something like knowing your audience and creating content that helps them. And then this is what it looks like. So step one, step two, step three, step four, step five, if you got those, and then explain how your service gets them that benefit, another benefit, and another benefit. You're just really saying how great your service is, but you've backed it up with evidence already. And then you're saying effective content strategy can give you the outcome you want. Wondering how you can use content strategy to get more leads, DM me content to discuss how it can help you. That's kind of how you'd write this. Here we got one year of work got me 3 million views and thousands of sales on autopilot for five years. So this is me using myself as a case study. So I turned YouTube views into paying clients and customers. Here's a breakdown. So I tell you the, the views that I got, the amount of videos that I made, and I say, how did I do it? By following this simple but powerful print principle, teach them everything they need and then sell them a way to make it fast and easy. Here's what this looks like in action. Give real value. Don't hold anything back. Give them all the info. Mention your offer. Offer convenience. So we've got the tip and then we explain it a little bit. Use SEO to rank high. The best part is content marketing showcases your experience, building trust and desire for your help. Effective content marketing sells while you sleep. Wondering how to create content that gets leads chasing your LinkedIn? DM me content for more details. What we're doing with this is we're giving an example of how we got the types of results our ideal client or target audience wants. And then we walk through the steps that we use to get those results and then we let them know that this is all because of the service that we provide. So if you provide a service that you've done for yourself, so you're your own case study, this is great. As well as if you've done this service for other people, you can use that as well. But you share a case study and then you share the steps of what you do with your offer. And then you let them know why your offer is so beneficial and tell them the next step that they need to take in order to discuss your offer with you. So that's that six different LinkedIn content ideas with post examples and templates that you can use right now. You could use these six ideas to create a week of content. If you create variations of it, you'll have months of content and you could consistently use these to create a bunch of content. If you want even more templates, you can get all 30 of these LinkedIn post templates by using the link in the description. If you've got any questions or any other tutorials you want me to make, let me know in the comment section down below and I'll see you in the next video.